This is part two of our bird's nest clay project. Once your clay project is completely dry, then you can start painting it. There's a couple options that you could use for paint. You could use tempera paint, which is what I'm using. It's a water-based paint. You could use acrylic, which is a little bit more permanent than tempera paint, or you could even just use plain watercolors. Those should work just fine. With my tempera paint I'm using, you could also do this with acrylic as well, but I'm using a little bit of extra water than I normally would to move that paint around. I also don't want the color to be too dark. I want it to be a little bit lighter than the original brown paints. I feel like it also is very helpful in getting those little cracks and crevices that we made with our plastic fork. So that's just my artistic choice. If you want the color to be really dark, then use less water and more paint. I'm gonna finish this up and then I'm gonna show you how to complete the eggs. So once you're done with your bird's nest, go ahead and paint the eggs however color you want. Just be really careful because they're gonna be small and a little bit harder to paint. Then make sure both are dry before you put it in your bird's nest. A couple other options that you could do is you can make a little paper bird to put inside or you could make it out of clay if you have extra clay or you could use that like green confetti as grass. Have fun with this.